Yo, what's up guys, Exploring with Danny, or I have a new name now, it's called Danny on the Loose. The reason why I've changed it, oh my god, I'm about to fall through the floor. <laughs> this is how dilapidated this house is, but yeah, I'm changing my name. I mean, it's time to branch out from the Exploring crew and to be somebody who's actually my, myself. Something where I can be a little more creative and a little bit different. So, yeah, so now my name is Danny on the Loose. I'm going to change it very soon. You guys are going to see some new content. I'm going to probably do some more like ghosty stuff. But yeah, right now we're at a house that nobody's really been to, and it's actually a really cool house with a cool room. I've been throughout the whole house already, so I'll show you guys uh, what we find in here. All right, this is the lobby room. It has an organ, and there's some really crazy looking preservatives here. Let me show you guys. Let's see. Yeah, see those jars? It's all nasty old preservatives, like hundreds and hundreds of year old like stuff in there. And they even left like a wheelchair there. It's kind of scary. It's an old school wheelchair too. It's not even like a new school one. Here in the living room, we don't have too much. Uh, a few couches, kind of like all the other houses I've been to. And an old Christmas tree with an angel on top. They even left their shoes behind there. Kitchen's all been raided out. Usually we find really nasty stuff inside the fridges. Usually like old food or moldy food, but this place is, actually doesn't have anything. Let's check. There's actually one more panel we can check right here. Yeah, no. Gross. And look, guys, look at that floor. You could literally fall to the basement if it has one. I tried to walk over there and actually my foot went through the floor a little bit. I want to see what's in that room. Guys, always stay with the side. Don't ever walk in the center. Oh god, everything's all squishy. Yeah, it's not worth it. It's literally just a bathroom with toilet paper in there. It is a nice bathroom, actually, for like an older style one. Yeah. Oh, I'm gonna fall through. Sucks being fat, huh? Uh, my last two videos got really messed up. For whatever reason, the audio was damaged. If you guys still want to see that video, let me know. I can probably do like a voiceover or something. Uh, I want to hear from you guys. I don't want to shoot out content that's gonna be like really low quality or garbage. I want you guys to have the best of the best, you know? Yeah, sorry it's so dark, but literally there's a bunch of sewing machines. This don't. This place was known as the Dollhouse. Apparently to my friends, that's what the name of this place was called. And there's a reason why. If I show you guys the, the room upstairs, you guys would be like, damn, scary stuff. This is probably the preserv preservative jars that they use. Obviously nothing in there. They probably preserve like old fruit and vegetables for all we know. Bunch of playing cards right there. I need to look at this stuff. What is it? Wow, there's like a floral background to it uh, chemicals just a bunch of old stuff that she probably didn't use she just threw it there a walker so you definitely know they're old and of course the mini piano let's keep moving folks I want to see that. oh wow I actually see a portrait of somebody let's take a look just have to blur this out this is a picture of a baby Born in 1989. I wonder who the heck this guy is. Keep it on the blur, Seth. So this dude, let's see. He's got a baby picture. Girl Scout cookies. Uh, also blur that out, Seth. Thank you. Um, what is in here? It's just photos of this kid. Oh, girl. This time again, it's there. okay. It's just an examination card, but guys, why would they put pictures of the family in there? That's creepy. If you guys ever come here, I actually manipulated this picture and I put that doll there. But look at that. Look at her eyes. That is freaking creepy, guys. What the heck? It has white freaking iris, like white colored eyes. It's insane. <laughs> in the doll's eyes mm -hmm. and like I felt something. So like, I walked over here and then all of a sudden this right here started moving. 
There's no draft in here whatsoever. And like, I'm like freaking out. Oh, that's why I'm here. <laughs> Dude, that's a creepy doll. I hate its eyes. The white, oh, it's like black and destroyed. The irises. It like looks like it's like following you too. That's the creepiest. I don't know, I've just been standing here. <laughs> Dude, I think it's insane. They literally have the portraits of the people here and they never took them away. Seth, make sure you block these out. They have wedding photos, look at that. Maybe the daughter for all we know. And there's some notes, let's look. Hi, Dad. Well, it's me, Paul. Oh my God, it's like an old, old note to his father. I'm gonna take a picture of that, it's crazy. A safe that's already been raided. And there's still actually some clothes in there. What the heck? Dude. I am not going in there by myself. That is scary. Hold on. Is there something scary in there? There's a big ass spider. Oh. <laughs> I'd go first, I'll eat the spider. You're gonna eat it? Yeah. I don't trust this floor. You can see right through it. It's just a bunch of doors. Oh, okay. Alright, yeah. so no ghosts. These are hidden bodies in there. Unfortunately. In case he has walls to go in there, I don't, unfortunately. Yo, if you guys hear anything scary on the audio, just know. This is probably like the torture room. This is actually really scary. It's like a small, like, little conjuring room or a hiding room. I don't see anything else because this is not a door. But it's literally, literally just a room. It said 1965. All of these do. October 2nd, 1965? Holy crap. I just got goosebumps again. Crazy. So somebody's been in this house since 1965. They left a notebook here and a bunch of... I just stepped on the same thing. <laughs> <laughs> it's a bunch of baby wow. pictures. 1965? Yeah, it's like old Polaroids. Me feeding Shy two years old. Shy? Shy on Anne's lap. That's my sister's nickname. <laughs> oh, I'm done. I'm done. Alright. This right. is my house. This room's pretty cool too. I do like that one. Wow. All right, I have a picture of Jesus here. Some prop clothing. This bed doesn't seem that bad. Sounds like somebody already set this up. Autographs. Wow, that's a, that's a great autograph right there. Love it. Somebody seems. I wonder what's in here. It's one of those. It's a closet with crutches in there. I think it's just insane to think about like there was a lady living here since 1965. I wonder who Shy is and where these people actually went. Um, the lady could have passed away, all the relatives could have left, but literally we have no clue. We, well, we have clues, but we just have no idea where the heck they went. And I think that's just the insane part. This is why I love houses. Because with the things that you find, there's like clues, you gotta put them all together. It's one of the most coolest things you can ever do. All right, so they have an old school record player. I don't even know what this dates back to. It's a silver, silver tone. Uh, no dates on it, unfortunately. And yeah, uh, old wedding photos. I'm surprised nobody's even touched it. Books. And I actually moved that doll. That doll was sitting over there. I just moved it over here to make a cool picture. But on that, look at that. That has a creepy, creepy doll. And there's pictures of Jesus everywhere. This was a really cool house. Glad I came. show you guys this room right now dudes all right so we'll start out with this look at how many dolls there are they have a bunch of dolls literally over there more dolls over there literally the dollhouse I love this bed too postcards you name it 
I want to find like an old photo book so I can at least know the, who the heck lived there. 